Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I hope you all are doing great. Today I'm going to be talking about a product which is a new launch in the market. I got this product for myself and I tried it on myself for some some good 6-7 times. And now I think I'm in a good position to review this product for you guys and let you know whether it's a hit or not worth it. Also guys, at the end of this video, I'm going to be announcing a Q&A video which I'm planning to do sometime soon. So I did post about it on my Instagram and even on my Facebook page and I'll just show you guys the post. So I have got a lot of questions already and I would really really appreciate and encourage the rest of you to send across more and more questions. It can be related to me, my personal life, my career, about beauty, fashion, hair, skin, makeup, anything, any such good stuff. So I'll just show you guys the post. So this is actually the post which is there on Instagram. It's me admiring some flower and I've also written on the post Q&A with me. So just leave your questions on this post. So I've already like kind of got some good amount of questions on this post and also you can leave your questions for this video uh, in the comment section below so for this particular video you can also leave your questions for my q a video or you can leave it here on that instagram post so just have a look once again guys so yeah so very soon i'm going to be doing a q a because now i feel that i've done almost 50 videos so it's good time it's high time to kind of get more interactive and interpersonal with each other and uh, i wish i could just have a face to face with you guys so maybe i can plan a meetup someday with you guys but as of now let's at least kind of interact in this virtual world and get to know each other more and i would also love to read about you guys so let me also know about yourselves what you do where you're from a lot of good stuff about yourself so i would love to know that as well and also at the end of this video i'm also going to be announcing a giveaway in fact i think i should just announce it right right here so with the q a video there will be a giveaway attached so one lucky winner who is going to be asking me questions about whatever topics I told you, whatever stuff I told you will also get a nice gift from me as a token of my love and appreciation. So now let's finally jump into the video for today which is the product review and the product that I'm going to talk about is the L'Oreal 12 Hour Magique Matte Magique Foundation. So it's as I said it's called the L'Oreal Matte Magique 12 Hour bright matte foundation i got the shade m3 for myself and today i'm actually wearing it i have already tried it some good six seven times ever since i've got it and i'm not putting anything else on my face guys it's just this particular foundation there is no concealer no highlighter i didn't even contour my face and no compact on my face whatsoever it's just this one product so this is how the ulterior packaging looks like it's a nice bright pink packaging with the name of the product and also the number which is reflected here now you will get a lot of different shades to choose from so i got n3 but they have actually launched a lot of different varieties of shades which i think is a very very big plus and this is how the tube looks like i really like the packaging it is so funky it's so girly girl kind of bright metallic pink and this is the tube and this tube has 30 ml of content in it which i think is pretty fine even if you use it every single day i think it's definitely going to last for at least a month so as you can see a dent here because i have been using it now so the packaging is this and i give a big thumbs up to the packaging and this is how the nozzle is like so it's like a thin narrow nozzle so a lot of product do not really come out of it you just end up squeezing it and getting as much product as you require so there is minimal amount of wastage of product unlike a lot of containers which have like a really wide mouth and you know just a lot of you know glob of product just pours on your hand or palette so this is not the case with this one i really like uh, the opening and uh, it also has SPF 11 so yeah that's also fine it's just uh, an add-on now as far as the product is concerned well as it says it's a matte foundation and I think it truly truly justifies the fact that it is a matte foundation it 
actually settles on your face absolutely matte you don't need a compact for it because if you put compact it's just gonna look too dry on your face so as I said I'm not putting any compact it's just that I sweat and as it is today I'm not turned on my AC so I'm a little bit sweating here and there but otherwise it is absolutely matte there is no glossiness or there is no like too much of uh, shine kind of thing on my face so for people who like matte finish this is the product for you I would highly recommend this product for oily skin people because even I tend to get very very oily skin especially during hot weather or humid rainy weather so the, I think this is a great product because it will just keep your skin nice and mattified and it also kind of helps control too much of oil exuding from your skin so for oily skin people this is a great product great foundation however for people who have dry skin well if you have dry skin then this product can get very very drying on your skin because it already has a very very matte kind of a texture to it <clears throat> excuse me by the way uh, bear with my voice because I had a very very bad throat past couple of days I am still sounding a lot better but I have a very sensitive throat so like every 15-20 days or something or the other happened to my throat so bear with me on that guys but um, yeah so for dry skin people it is very drying but if you still want to use this foundation what I will recommend is that you can mix a little bit of moisturizer in this foundation and then you can apply it so it will kind of be a nice uh, nourishing moisturizing kind of a base for you and you will not feel very dry so try that out I'm sure it's gonna work for dry skin people as well another thing about this product is that it's pretty blendable so I just used a stippling foundation brush to apply this foundation today and I could just very conveniently and very easily blend it all over my face and you know it just was a an absolutely effortless kind of a situation where you I don't have to really struggle blending with this product as far as the text the texture the consistency is concerned I initially thought it's a BB cream because the packaging is very much like a BB cream like you normally don't get foundations in a tube and when I took it out on my hand it looked like a BB cream but it actually is a proper foundation the coverage however is medium to slightly buildable I won't say it's a high coverage or it's a full coverage foundation today I have done two coats of this foundation on my face so apply, I applied first coat and then I just thought to kind of uh, go again with another coat so this is the coverage that I have got and I'm pretty happy with the coverage as I said there is no concealer on my face there is no highlighter there is only this one particular product on my face and I'm quite happy with uh, you know the kind of matte finish that it has given on my face and it's, it's just a natural looking bright and fresh and kind of a flawless finish that I've got on my face and I'm pretty happy with that so the coverage is medium to a little more buildable you can put two to three layers max I think two layers are good enough don't go beyond that and it will give you a nice coverage a natural looking finish so that is also another plus point of this product now we come to the price now L'Oreal launching a new product at this price I think that's a big plus so this product actually retails for 595 rupees which is like close to 600 rupees so for this size you are getting so for 600 rupees you're getting this size of a product which has all these uh, features which I discussed with you guys I think it's worth a buy do give it a shot guys because I don't think any product from L'Oreal costs you anything less than 800 even their kajals and gold pencils are 800 plus rupees so for 595 rupees you're getting this product so you can definitely definitely give it a try otherwise I give this product a thumbs up the only thing is that for people with dry skin you might have to kind of find out ways and means to use this product so as I suggested you can just mix a little bit of uh, moisturizer in this product and you can apply it and see for yourselves if it works or if it, does, if it doesn't so guys this is my review of the L'Oreal Matte Magique 12 hour bright matte foundation and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video I definitely recommend you guys to go and check this product out try it out for yourselves and do select the shades a little more consciously because what happened was I bought it from New You so 
fun, it's a very funny thing that the testers that they had didn't have any shade number on it whereas uh, the final product the, 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 the fresh product did have number like it's mentioned here but the testers had no number so I just did a guesswork for myself looking at the shade which is there on the cover that this probably would go with my skin because N1 was much lighter than this and N4 seemed to be darker uh, for my skin tone so I just did a guesswork and it worked perfectly fine for me so I don't know if it was that particular lot of testers which didn't have a number on it which I feel normally never happens with any of the products or brands they always have numbers on the testers as well only then you can finally decide for yourselves what which shade to buy or not so anyways that's just one thing which I experienced so I'm sharing with you guys so guys uh, as I said please leave your uh, comments about this video about this product if any one of you have already been using it then do let me know how you like this product please start putting in your questions in this video down below in the comment section or on the Instagram post and also on my Facebook post if you guys follow me on my Facebook business page I have the same post there as well you can leave your questions there or you can also email me your questions because I do leave my email ID down below in the description box so guys till we meet next time stay happy stay safe stay beautiful always be positive and do keep watching my videos show this video a thumbs up leave your comments and do subscribe to my channel take care all love you bye bye